You've been coming here 26 years. Take 26 years away from your age. That's a lot of time. We were young. You know, it's a shame that our government don't see why the hell we're really here. Uh, they left it behind. They know they left it behind. They just keep whining about World War II, Korea, Vietnam, and uh, we got Sergeant Chloe Bernal. And, uh, Four years, and they know where he is. And they also look at him again. When we have half those terrorists in captivity in Guantanamo Bay, when the president wants to shut down, we don't need it. What are we going to do for him here? I don't think so. Uh, they released prisoners, terrorists that we had in captivity. And they don't put any bargaining chips on the table. They just let them go and don't get on this. Why not? Why not? It's not their son or daughter. They can give it a damn life. You know, there was some years ago, I think it was about six, seven years ago, there was a congressman or senator went down south somewhere in South America. They got plain chocolate and everything out there looking for that guy. Right away. But why don't they do that for our Our village. Those who give their lives, give their swag, their money, to everything else on up the hill and fight the dirty war that this country gets us in. When nobody else out there in far countries really give a damn about America, they don't love you, they don't love me, they don't love themselves. All they want to do is kill each other. So why don't we just let our rat in Afghanistan and our rat kill each other? Well, we don't have to worry about it.
And why are they buying 3,000 APCs? And I threw Fidel Carrier to play around the country. You tell me that. Thank you. Be safe. We have to very, be very safe tomorrow. Okay? God bless you. God bless the United States of America. And God bless our military. By the way, just, just to give, in case anybody wants